Sue is calling now from Marilyn Thompson uh, of Reuters, who edited this piece. And uh, Sue is calling from Hartford, Connecticut, Independent. Hi there. Hi. Um, I was wondering whether um, what what Marilyn's opinion is about um, uh, the formation of a, of a consumer group to oversee lobbying in general, uh, these trips specifically, a, a consumer group formed by voters rather than by Congress. Uh, is there any mechanism to do that? Does she know? Um, and and how, um, how would that be done? Well, um, I would say that, yeah, there's certainly a way to do that, and there's, uh, there are new groups springing up all the time that, that, uh, that have watchdog fun functions uh, here in Washington. I can't tell you how valuable that is uh, to the process. Uh, it, you know, we rely on not just groups like this Legistorm, um, but groups like the Sunlight Foundation, and uh, there, there are many, many of them uh, already operating here in Washington. And when they decide to take on a specific issue, like congressional travel or, or anything else, expense, office expenses on the Hill, they do an amazing job in uh, both getting records that the public can then review, uh, and consolidating that information into something that you can use and do stories from. They're great for journalists. Um, so yeah, there is a, there is a way for that to spring up.